In this video, I am going to explain to you how to enable remote desktop on your Windows 10 computer. This is pretty much similar to Windows 11 and also in the older version of Windows 7. To do that, go to your search bar and type in settings. Click on the settings. Then go to systems and then click on remote desktop and this is where you enable remote desktop just click on the toggle radio button and then you will see enable remote desktop you and users selected under user accounts will be able to connect to this PC remotely so click confirm and now you go to select users that can remotely access this PC and you need to add them otherwise you cannot connect to this computer remotely click add and you can type in the path here but it is kind of a little tricky the recommended way to do that is click on advanced find now and now you can add people who can connect to this computer remotely I will add administrators and also click on advanced find and I'm going to add a guest also which is guest A so you have two people selected here click OK now you see administrator and guest are in the list click OK and close now now you can go to another PC and connect to this computer so make sure you know the IP address of this computer it is advisable to set a static IP on this computer but if this computer is always on in your environment and you know the IP address that is also fine I'm going to see the IP address going into the command prompt IP IP config and the IP address of this computer is 192.168.0.235 so let's go to other computer and try to connect to this computer remotely now I am at a different computer which is in upstairs and I'm trying to connect to my downstairs PC using RDP to do that click on the search and type in remote desktop connection and this is the IP address 192.168.0.235 and you can go to show options and you can type in the username which is guest A connect and I'm going to type in the password now you are connected to the downstairs computer using RDP and you can see the IP address of that remote computer here 192.168.0.235 this is how you enable remote desktop for different users in Windows environment if you like this video give me a thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification for future useful videos